So Professor Yerabali, what are we going to learn today? We're going to learn to use the cystic timer to get precise delays. Precision like this is required in real-time systems. So what kind of systems are we talking about? Systems where not meeting precise delays can have consequences. Consequences ranging from minor inconveniences to serious catas catastrophes. You mean like air traffic control or nuclear power plants or even the anti-lock brakes in your car? Yes. We will also build an abstraction called the finite state machine which makes us design complex systems using a simple abstraction that lends itself to provability of functions. Ah, so a finite state machine is a design process that is easy to verify. Yes, because there's a rich set of theory behind it. And the best thing is, the same engine that we build for one finite state machine can be used no matter how complex the system is. So does that mean I can reuse your code, your engine, in my finite state machine? That is correct. That sounds good, but what are we going to build then? We're going to build things with stepper motors, which are common motors used in embedded systems when we want to have something that moves. Ooh. A stepper motor like this is going to, is part of any embedded system that has movement as one of its features. Yeah, and we're going to show you this autonomous robot. It has a microcontroller, a battery, two stepper motors, and lots of sensors. Let's do it. Yeah, come on. 